Good morning, everybody. Last night, Emma had a rough night. I wanna say it might be because today, or no, yesterday, she hit four weeks old, which is so crazy. I can't believe she's been in our lives for four weeks now. It feels like she's always been here almost. Um, so she had a rough night. I had to hold her a lot, and it was just, it was a long night. So I did not get much sleep, and I actually kind of have been thinking about getting coffee this morning, which is, obviously not like me because i don't drink coffee that's how tired i am you guys she was up literally all night long wanting to be held you can probably tell by the look on my face which is why there's no makeup but now i am awake and i'm going to take my morning vitamins from care of so thank you care of for sponsoring this video you guys know I'm still only four weeks postpartum, which is why it's so important for me to still be taking like my prenatal and my vitamins and everything and staying healthy for Emma and healthy for myself, obviously. If you guys have not heard of Care Of, they are a vitamin company that helps you pick out vitamins that you need based on your health and your lifestyle. You take this short five minute quiz, it's super easy, and they send you personalized vitamin packs just like mine in that cute little container and it makes things so much easier to remember to take every day and it's really cool that it's based on what you need so like mine has a prenatal fish oil calcium and i think a b complex but everyone's is going to be different so the prices for these packs start at just 20 dollars a month depending on what is in your pack but if you want to try it out the first 100 people that click the link in my description box and use the code rochelle will get 25 percent off of your first order so go check that out be quick and get your vitamins and stay healthy okay we are out the door we are actually going to go to the p.o box today um not just because we need to pick stuff up but because i have some orders to ship from my poshmark and that sling that i got that i showed you guys they are sending me the one with the right color rings that i did order so i have to send this one back to them to return it some poshmark things so hopefully it won't be too bad she had a little bit of a struggle going into her car seat but she seems content now so i'm gonna get driving before she has another milk Wow, I haven't been to the post office in like a really, really long time. Oh shoot, you know what? I had Justin take the P.O. box key. I can't even check it. What is wrong with me? I'm gonna see if, because it's in my name, I tell them I lost the key, if they will let me check it anyways, but I don't know. It worked, you guys. I was able to check the P.O. box for the first time in like six weeks, finally. <laughs> I know that we have told you guys in the past to stop sending stuff to P.O. Box, but we get so many messages every day from you guys asking if you can send Emma something or a card or a letter or a painting or anything. You guys, if you want to send something, go ahead. I feel bad telling you guys no that I don't want to accept items. So, you know what? If you guys want to send something to Emma or Justin or I, just go ahead. Hi, buddy. I just got home. I wanted to show you guys how cute Mr. was sleeping when I got home. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> He's just laying upside down on the couch. Um, but right when I was pulling into the garage, I pulled down my visor and I forgot that I had these ultrasound pictures from when I was pregnant at, when was this one that looks 36 weeks and four days? So three weeks before she was born. I'm curious. Do you guys think that she kind of looks like her ultrasound picture? I think in this one more so than this one because this one, if it'll focus, this one I wasn't as far along so she looks thinner. But this one, I can see it. I don't know, what do you guys think? Do you think she looks like it? I'm curious if they were pretty accurate for you guys. All of our ultrasounds were very accurate when it came to weight. Um, but the looks I'm not too 100% on, but let me know what you guys think because, ugh. Those were the best thing in the world when you're pregnant is seeing those 3D ones and getting like a tiny glimpse. And even if it's not 100%, I think it's amazing the technology to kind of get a hint of what they're going to look like. Okay, I just opened some of these gifts and you guys, thank you so much for everyone who sent stuff to celebrate Emma. Whether it was clothes like Julia and Mackenzie and Amanda, they all sent these amazing clothes. Some little shops. This is from Kate and Kids. This is amazing. Julia, no, Tanya. Tanya and her daughter, daughter Ariana, I can't speak, made this quilt for Emma. 
I can't quilt and I'm so jealous. I would have loved to learn. And her daughter picked out like some little gifts for her. We got some gifts from little like mugs from Amy and some chocolate. If you guys see your gift here, like seriously, thank you so much. That was so sweet. And you guys are always so nice to us and just wanted to celebrate Emma and that is the sweetest thing that I could have ever even imagined. So you guys are amazing. I don't even know what to say. I even thank you so much. And <laughs> Emma says thank you too. You guys are the best. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is her first time napping in her crib. She's such a big girl and I don't like it. Come on, Bo. I don't like leaving her. Come on. But she's napping so good in here that I think I'm gonna just let her stay in here and probably run up here to check on her every five or six minutes knowing me. But I'm so proud. Oh, Mama's here. Come here. Oh. Well, that did not last long, huh? That's okay. Mama didn't want it to last too long. You're growing up too quickly. <laughs> This is a lot of stuff. <laughs> Sorry, I was making fun of you. I know, everyone did. Wow. Thank you guys all so much for and everybody that sent us all this stuff. It's awesome. And then another thing too, we got something else the other day in the P.O. Oh, box. I forgot to mention It was that. this like little security bit set for my drill. I don't know who sent it. There was no note or anything, but oh, it's like Amazon's this amazing. entire bit set with every type of bit that there is. And I was like, this is awesome. And I don't know if somebody was watching me do my work uh, my workbench stuff but I'm pretty sure that's why somebody had the thought so whoever said that please thank you and leave a comment below so that we can properly thank you that was really awesome and totally unnecessary but I really appreciate that in advance and I am definitely looking forward to using that because I was so like mad when I couldn't get those screws out of my workbench and now I can do it so thank you guys and now it is bath time are you getting in the bath in the I sink? Wish. I wish I could. I don't like baths unless it's a brand new I'll bathtub. Give, I'll give you a bath. <laughs> Justin, stop! <laughs> what? <laughs> Look we at you, though. You're so cute. Go on, stop. get in. <laughs> we need the towels. Yes, we do. But let's get this little cute angel all bathed <laughs> before she gets fussy again. Well, I think the bath Because I walked in the door and Rochelle was in the middle of trying to calm her down and she didn't fuss with me so that's always oh, good shush. <laughs> <laughs> emma i wish i got baths this nice girl you look so comfy and cozy mom even puts a nice little warm washcloth on you while she rubs you so you don't get cold she still loves it yeah, so yeah she never fusses in the bath it's, it's just when she gets out yes yeah. once she starts getting a little bit cold oh she hates it yeah, well, we tried oh, to put her so, towel in the dryer usually. Oh, it's so usually. bad. Oh, that's the worst. We tried to put her towel in the dryer usually, but today we can't because there's stuff Mama in there already. Doing. Yeah, I think those are dirty. I don't think she's going to understand oh. that, though. She's going to be pretty mad. Look at that red hair. Hi, baby. Look at that red hi, Bo. hair. You want a bath, too? Look at that. Oh, hi. Look at it, it's like hi, <laughs> round. <kitty. laughs> what are you doing? Are you just showing off for everybody? You're so cute. 
tried to line it up as best as I could so you can kind of tuck her head in there as, as best as we can. Oh, I know. I know. We're getting you. I love this towel. It's so warm and cozy compared to the other ones we have. Right. I love it when we wrapped up in here. It's my favorite. Look at baby. Look at you. <laughs> He's so pretty. Look at those eyes. Oh, you melt my heart every day. And every single day. Okay, I am hoping that the swing is gonna help soothe her until bedtime. I don't want her to fall asleep, but just, she's usually pretty chill in there, just looks at the mobile and we have her swaddled. So hopefully that kind of chills her out for about 30 minutes and then we're gonna go to bed. Justin's upstairs getting a shower, so I'm gonna end the vlog alone, but we will talk to you guys again tomorrow. Thank you so much for loving our family. I never say this, but if you guys aren't subscribed, make sure you hit the subscribe button below so you don't miss any videos. And if you hit the little bell notification, then every time we upload, you will get a notification letting you know. Or if we post in like the community tab or anything, you'll be the first people to know. So do that if you guys have not, and we will talk to you guys again tomorrow. Good night.